be completed by next year. Hey folks, we're a little more than 24 hours away from the NBA draft. The big talk tonight is who's going to go number one for the Atlanta Hawks. And while that pick is the only one we have for the Hawks yeah. on Wednesday. There's still plenty of reason to watch for some local talent here. Today, Reggie Chapman spoke with some of those players at the NBA Draft Host Hotel in New York City. He's right there joining us live now. Reggie, who all have you spoken to? What have you learned? Hey guys, welcome inside the lot New York Palace here in New York City, where earlier today we got to meet with the top 24 prospects ahead of the 2024 NBA draft. And of course, there's some local connections. Over at Overtime Elite in Atlanta, two guys, Rob Dillingham and Alex Saar, as well as a couple of former high school stars, and Isaiah Collier and Stefan Castle. Those two have been playing against each other for quite a long time. Castle was at Newton High School, while Collier played at Wheeler. The two of them grew up playing against each other and after both playing a year of college basketball will continue to compete in the NBA. Both these guys excited about the opportunity to play at the next level and have an impact on whatever team selects them on Wednesday night. I just really I've been, you know, going through the process, just, you know, betting on myself, like doing everything with, with confidence. I've been thinking about this moment for forever now, as long as I can remember. So, um, you know, I'm super excited. I mean, for me, I feel like I'm the best player in the draft. So, I mean, for me, it's just, you know, showing that hard nose, I'm willing to compete, doing anything to win. Uh, simple as that. Taking advantage of it all uh, as far as just, just enjoying the process, you know, not worrying too much. I mean, just knowing I'm going to be fine. These two guys actually trained ahead of the draft with each other, just pushing each other along the way. Tomorrow will be a really cool moment for both those guys who will continue their journeys on basketball's biggest stage. All right, Reggie, thanks a lot. We